Good morning. I hope everyone had a very happy 4th of July and are enjoying the beautiful weather and weekend that we have in store for us. This one uh, this week is always really busy because a lot of people start their summer vacations on the 4th of July week. So we'll, we're bound to see more traffic and more rentals being taken up and people will decide at the last minute they want to come down and come on down. There's, a, there's still a lot of rentals available. Um, I know that over COVID and with all of that, there's been a lot of influx of rentals um, that people have converted. So take a look online. I'm sure you'll find something that fits your needs perfectly. When it comes to fitting your needs, also think about when you're buying a house and what fits your needs today and what will fit your needs for the next five to 10 years. The average homeowner is only in their house for under 10 years. So don't worry about finding your forever home every time you look. Think about finding the home that's gonna be right for you for the next 10 years. So that could be, you know, as your children are growing. Um, let's say you have a home and a major, um, a big home and, and your kids are out of college. Is that home gonna suit you 10 years from now? Um, if you're looking on the Cape, a little beach house is fine for one, two, or four people. Um, are you finding that you have a lot of people coming down? Do you have a lot of visitors? Do the kids bring all their friends down? Maybe you need something a little bit bigger. Or the opposite could be true. The kids are gone, they don't wanna come to the Cape. You're on the Cape, so they, they want something, uh, or you may need something a little bit smaller. So just keep in mind, it's never um, a forever home, it's always a for now home. That's my tidbit for the week. Have a great week, everybody.